All right, Coach Grimm, big weekend for volleyball. Off to your best start in 21 years for the SAU volleyball program. Talk about your matches this weekend. Uh, well, we, uh, we we drove up to uh, southwest Oklahoma uh, State and played them at Weatherford. Uh, got off the bus and uh, warmed up and looked like we were still on the bus a little bit. That first set was a little rough, but uh, the girls rebounded and uh, we ended up with uh, a 3-1 win over Southwest. Southwest really played hard. Uh, they're always tough on their home court and uh, I was really proud of our girls stepping up and uh, bouncing back from a rough first set. First set. Uh, any, anytime you see a team that loses 25-11 in the first set, a lot of teams will uh, have trouble rebounding and we stepped up and won the next three so I was really proud of our kids. Uh, the next night we played Northwest Oklahoma which is their first time to have a volleyball program uh, and so they're very young and everything and and uh, we played with played very well against them. We uh, uh, had some sets that they kind of uh, bounced up on us a little bit, but um, you had to give Northwest credit. They didn't give up and they battled us even though we beat them pretty tough to, to two sets. I was really proud of how our kids managed the challenge and took, took, took the set 3-1. All right, so recovering from that long road trip because you were on the road quite a while, and now mm -hmm. you come back to practice. What are you working on this week? Well, you know, we got our oh, what's talk about is tomorrow night. So, you know, what we're we're doing today is we're going over scouting report stuff, getting touches, uh, trying to prepare as much as we can. We've already played Watch Talk Baptist once this year, so we kind of know what they want to do, but we want to go over some key things that we were struggling with this past weekend uh, to kind of prepare for uh, OBU. Uh, so we're we're just preparing for them, and then we got this big tournament this coming weekend that we're also preparing for as well. Uh, it's the uh, it's a crossover tournament with the MIAA and the GAC conferences playing each other. Uh, those teams are very well coached teams as well, and it's going to be a very tough week. So we're trying to prepare our kids for to, for each and every every team, but also prepare ourselves to clean up some of the problems we had in, in some matches we've had in the past. All right, still got some big matches coming up later on in the season. Haven't played Harding, haven't played Correct. Arkansas Tech, so mm -hmm. uh, maybe this regional tournament will kind of help show you where you're at. And that's the one reason why we're playing it. It's not only because of region rankings, it's also to prepare us for those tougher teams in the conference that we haven't played yet, uh, as well as getting ready for the postseason, because in the postseason we're going to be playing games back to back to back, and this is a tournament situation where we're going to be playing multiple games in multiple days, and so it gives you that tournament feeling not only for the regular season, but also preparing for the uh, conference tournaments as well. All right, Coach, you will have played five matches by the time we talk again, so we'll have a lot to talk about next week, and uh, we do thank you for your time. Thank you.